I'm an artist and in this video I will tell you the most important thing you need to know if you want to be a self-taught artist for the next 4 minutes. But first, let's cover the basics. So let's go and first remember that the internet will be your best friend in this question. Whenever you don't know how to do or draw something, you just go and google it. But what exactly should you be looking for? Here is some tips for you. So first, YouTube tutorials are incredibly helpful. It's like having a personal teacher because there are video for every question you have. And here are some great channels that will help you. Proko. You will learn all the fundamentals you need, especially for traditional art. Scenic Design. If you want to learn how to draw faces, you must check his tutorials. Mark Brunet. This man has a lot of videos, like how to draw landscapes, anatomy, faces, characters, or environment. These three channels will really help you as they help me. And if you know some other good art channels, write them in the comments. Next tip, it's a references. If someone says references are cheating or something like that, they're really wrong. Remember, if you want to learn how to draw, you need references because you must know the structure of the objects you draw or the anatomy someone you draw. And if you draw poses without references, there are no sense in your learning because you must know how it really looks like. Next thing you need to do, it's a practice. When I talk about practice, I mean you must practice to draw just everything, not only your original character. Because in the end, you will able to draw only your original character. So you must practice also a perspective, like anatomy, lining, shading, line art, uh, like composition and a lot of other stuff. And I recommend you to separate this. Like for example, you can draw anatomy for one week and then perspective the next week and so on. This method helps you avoid art block because you will draw different things and it makes your learning not so boring. It's not must be exactly in one week. Choose what works best for you, maybe it's a 3 days or 20 days, I don't know. But all this is useless without next. Discipline. Being a self-taught artist is a good because you can learn art as intensely as you feel comfortable. But it's all zero if you don't have discipline and don't build your own art routine. One more thing that can help you. Set goals you want to achieve. This will be a motivation for you and will help you understand what you need to do first. Like for example, if you want to be a character designer, you won't start by learning how to draw landscapes. And last tip that most people think is useless or stupid, I don't know why, but you must watch, watch and observe art and drawing process of other great artists and think, why did he make this lighting like that, why he used these colors, and why characters place it here but not there. And all this can help you understand art better because you will learn from the artist that better than you and has a lot more experience than you. So this one thing you need to know to be a self-taught artist. Subscribe if you like this video for more content like this. And thank you for watching.